feel? It feels good. You know, we, we worked hard all week. Um, the guys really put in all the effort, um, and it feels good to come out with a win. Did they do anything different defensively than you thought? Uh, it seemed like uh, maybe they were a little bit more prepared for the tempo than maybe in years past. And now, what did you see right. from them? Exactly. They were they were pretty ready for those for our tempo. And um, but you know, my hats off to them. They came out and played hard. But I, I'm just proud of my guys, man. They they went out. They executed the best that we could, and we just ended up being successful. Josh and Braylon have ball games. Yes, sir. They had a great game, and they, that's token to what they've done all week. Um, they practiced hard, and you know, I'm proud of those guys. Can you appreciate how you played though today? I mean, it's 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 a team sport, really, and um, you know, it's it takes all 11 guys to go out there and, and work hard and execute to, to be successful. You guys see played on the road. You guys see played on the road before. What was like here tonight? Um, it was definitely hostile. Yeah. It was loud. Um, you know, the fans were, were very into it. Um, but like I said, we 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 practiced those situations all week in practice, and uh, we were pretty prepared for it. Was it fun to be able to play four quarters? <laughs> it definitely was. Um, you know, they. Like I said, it's it's fun to just be out there, you know, and to be out there with the guys. And um, like I said, they did a great job. I'm proud of those guys. What did you tell the guys when you took the field up 31-24 uh, when they cut the lead to seven? We just had to go out there and, and just do our thing, just go out there and execute. Uh, I just told the guys, relax, we're fine. Um, just take it one play at a time, and, and we'll end up being successful. How worried you about Josh's injury? I'm sorry? How worried were you about Josh's injury? Uh, I was just worried for him, and I wasn't sure what was going on. Um, but, you know, he came out, he fought through it, and he played well. What kind of lift did he give you guys coming back out on the field? Oh, Josh is a, a difference maker, and to be able to have him back on the field uh, means the world to us as an offense. How about the deep ball to him? Can you tell us about that play? Um, they kind of came out in one of those looks that, um, you know, it was a man free look. Mm -hmm. The safety ended up taking one of the one of our other receivers, and Josh was just running down by himself, and I was able to find him. It, for me, I, we try to just take it, you know, the same every week, and um, you know, we're not trying to put more, more earnest on one person. You know, we just want to go out there and do our best, and, and that's what we did. What's the difference between Braylon these last few weeks compared to like the first few weeks of the season? How, what is it that's led to his emergence? He's he's gone and he's worked hard, um, and he's been able to find the find the open zones. You know, he's been able to get open. Um, and that guy, when you get that guy the ball, he's unbelievable. He can make plays. And like I said, he's, he's one of those guys that we got to continue to find on the ball. He, he'll continue to make plays for us, and he's going to be a, a huge, huge difference maker for us. It looks, it looks like Braylon's route running was pretty solid. They had a couple of double moves. Yeah, yeah. And it, was, it happened that you know Washington was a little aggressive, um, and we ended up getting, getting open a little bit. Mark, is your heart rate ever elevated today? Is there ever pressure? <laughs> Um, not at all. You know, we, we always kind of have this deal. If, if we're prepared, we don't we don't feel pressure. And um, the coaches do an awesome job all week of just making sure we're prepared for any situation. And, and uh, we go in with a lot of confidence. And, and that's what I felt this week. How different did it feel doing it out there as opposed to inside the ball? <laughs> you know, obviously it's a little different. Um, any game game situations, there'll, there'll be a little more emotion. But um, like I said, we, we were prepared. And uh, we understood that if we just have all the confidence in ourselves, we can go out there and do it. you feel like the game kind of changed? Uh, you know, towards the third quarter when our defense got a couple of those stops, you know, and we were able to go down and score, I felt, you know, really just kind of, you know, push the momentum our way, and, um, you know, it just ended up being successful. The second quarter, you went to the bench and Jeff Lockett started warming up. Were you concerned about your knee at all? You came back and played fine, obviously. Yeah, it was just a little sore. Um, you know, one of those deals that I uh, just kind of landed a little weird, and um, but I'll be fine. Did you know ahead of time that DeAnthony wasn't going to go today? Um, you know, we, we weren't too sure. Um, you know, that stuff is left up to Coach Alvarez. How important was the long touchdown pass? Three plays after Sanchez, long touchdown. Was You're right. Um, just to get the momentum back was huge. Um, this is this game is pretty. You know, depending on shifts, the, if the momentum shifts one way or the other, it can can lead to good or bad things. So, you know, it's huge for us to come out and, and get that that long touchdown and uh, really just kind of got our offense in a rhythm. You're never satisfied with any of the games. Was this pretty close to being a complete performance for you? I mean, I don't know. I, I'm just, for me, I'm just going to continue to look to get better. Um, obviously, I can look at the film, and there's some things that I can can tune up. Um, and that's the mentality that I, you know, want to have. It's the mentality that we've built around here. And if I continue to do that, hopefully, uh, you know, this offense will be in good situations. You guys always talk about the faceless opponents, but how important is it to beat Washington rival ten times in a row? It's it's huge for our fans. Um, you know, it's. One of those deals that, like you said, we, we treat every every single opponent um, as a faceless opponent, and it doesn't matter who we're playing. 
Uh, we just want to come out and execute the best that we can. Hey Marcus, what did you learn about this team just from the way you guys responded to being in a close game finally? We have a lot of good character guys, um, and they, they, they work hard and they want the best for the team. And um, you know, it, it it's hard to it's hard to kind of show what goes on you know un, behind the scenes you know with in practice and stuff. But those guys they work hard every single day in practice, and they just really showed today. What so was your mind when they called the exact same play that you tackled for one yard game and you scored? I decided to score. Uh, I mean, it, it happened where, um, you know, that one defensive player made a great play. Um, and I felt that, you know, it was open. And I was glad that they called it again. And, you know, Hironis and um, they led me down into the end zone. I was, you know, those guys made some huge blocks. So, fish in the red zone, I think six or six, seven to seven down there. Anything change for you when you're directing an offense in that 20? You know you need to get some touchdowns. You know, for us, especially as the quarterback position, you don't want to you don't want to give up the ball. So that's the main focus. This is you know don't take a sack, uh, don't don't have any turnovers. But you know if we're if we're able to just score every time we're down there, obviously that's going to put our team in a good situation, and and that's what we look to do. Earlier this week, talked about how good their quarterbacks were. Obviously, Braylon Josh had some good success. What did you think about them? The way you picked them apart? It was. Josh and Brandon and the rest of the receivers just their route running. Um, you know they were able to get open, and really I was just able to find them. And you know those guys did an awesome job getting open. And you know I'm proud of those guys. Really. Everybody wants to take care of the ball at your position. Every quarterback does. But why have you been so successful at that this season? The coaches can harp on it every single day in practice, um, and it's always you know finish every single play with the ball. Mm -hmm. And you know it's if you continue to to play with the ball. I mean obviously. Um, you know, if there's situations where you got to fit it in a little bit, you got to. But, you know, they just tell us to be careful with the ball and make sure that we always finish every single play with the ball.